Okay, good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for joining us today to recognize our athletes who will take their talents to the college level next year. To know that the St. Catharines Athletic Experience helped propel our girls to have the desire and determination to pursue a dream is an honor for our program, our coaches, and for those of you who are teammates. It also confirms the outstanding history of the St. Catharines program and allows girls coming after them to have something tangible to further fuel their desire to set lofty athletic goals and commit to athletic excellence. We'd like to thank these senior athletes and their parents for their dedication to Saints athletics and for managing student athlete expectations in all areas of their lives. The exciting opportunity to be a student athlete at the college level is very special and we wish all of you the very best in representing your colleges next year. However, let's be clear, you all have a lot of unfinished business at St. Catharines first. <laughs> Okay, uh, first, I'd like to tell you about Tally Applewhite. She's probably... <laughs> Tally is probably the most respected goalkeeper in the state. She helped lead the Saints soccer team to an undefeated season, the LAS and state championship last spring. She was named the state player of the year. She holds the school record for the best save percentage. The United States Naval Academy matched up best with Tally's high expectations, though she was courted by several Division I programs. Tally, tell us who has inspired you the most to want to play at the next level. Emily Wig. Oh, she's my goalkeeper coach at uh, St. Catharines. Awesome. Congratulations, Tally. Sign away and you guys can jump in there. She has the neatest handwriting. If you've never seen her handwriting, it's worth a look at her letter. <laughs> Congratulations, Tally. How about a big round of applause? bracket sport athlete who decided to focus on squash a couple of years ago. She's incredible to watch on the court and she has worked tirelessly to grab the attention of college recruiters. She will make an impact on the Denison squash program next year. Lane, tell us what you're most looking forward to competing at the college level next year. Um, I'm really excited to start competing at the next level and I'm just so excited to get to Ohio. <laughs> Okay, congratulations. In case you can't image in your head red and white balloons here, you can look up in the trees and see them. Congratulations, Lane. Sally is a field hockey, basketball, and lacrosse standout for the Saints. She is never outworked or out hustled. She's a playmaker as a point guard in basketball and leading scorer in lacrosse. Sally will be such an asset to the Swanee lacrosse program next year. Sally, tell us who has helped influence you to want to achieve at this level. All of my coaches and my teammates and my family who have pushed me to realize that I have the potential to play at the next level. Awesome. Congratulations. <laughs> That's a heavily used hat right there. Congratulations, Sally. <laughs> Ainsley is a field hockey indoor track and lacrosse standout for the Saints. She works hard at all of her sports, including pole vaulting. You should see her do that. Ainsley has found her next home at Wofford, where she will play lacrosse and likely have an immediate impact. Ainsley, tell us what excites you most about playing at the next level. 
um, experiencing a new team environment and a new level of intensity. Awesome. Did everybody hear that? Congratulations, Ainsley. We're excited for you. Sydney is such a good jumper in track and such a good soccer player in the spring season that she may have had some choices for sports next year. But she has settled on field hockey at Swanee. She just keeps getting better every day and should have an immediate impact on the Swanee field hockey program. Congratulations, Sid. <laughs> Who has been influential in your athletic career? My parents, my family, and my amazing coaches. Awesome. All of these letters have a note that they will leave me in their will. <laughs> Congratulations, Sid. Catherine has dedicated an enormous amount of her time to being the best goalkeeper that she can be. She has looked for every opportunity to learn from the best and better her skills. She is the consummate teammate and will slide into helping the Randolph-Macon hockey team next year. Catherine. <laughs> Catherine, tell us what you uh, what you are most looking forward to next year. I think I'm really excited to play at a higher level, and I'm really excited to play with everybody on the team because they're so kind and amazing. These girls create quite a core in the senior class. Congratulations, Catherine. We're excited for all of them, and we have a lot of our great coaches here flanking all of these great athletes. So we're proud of all of you. We're excited for you today, and we look forward to all the things you're going to do the rest of this year at St. Catherine's in helping our teams achieve. So congratulations to all, and um, we do have some chocolate chip cookies up here as you leave, if you want to take one. Let's um, cheer on our Saints teams who are all competing for state championships in the next couple of days. And uh, we had a good day yesterday and have several, three teams going to the final four uh, of the states. Congratulations, everybody. Yep. We're going to do a few photos, family photos, and then we need all of you, six of you to come up in front of here. Thank you all so much for coming today. Really appreciate it. Remember this day, November 10th, it's 80 degrees. Come on, Dave.